Hello there, it's, it's Elizabeth from Norway here with a new card. Um, first, I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas, peaceful and uh, with all your loved ones. Uh, and then did some art. I did a little, not a lot. We had a house full of people all the time, so it wasn't any time actually to do some art. But I did a little. And I've done this card for you. This is a New Year's card. Um, I know there's a, there's a couple of days since New Year's, but it doesn't really matter. This is a fun little project with a lot of different uh, techniques. I have some embossing here, uh, watercolors, gouache, painting, and uh, so on. So, and uh, the framing of this card is a little bit special. I, I do this kind of framing a lot on my watercolor uh, um, pieces. Uh, I really like that crisp uh, edging of the uh, actual cardstock uh, instead of uh, uh, layer it. Uh, but I will show you how I did it and uh, it's it's fun, I promise you. And there's some salt technique here as well. So lots of different techniques. Hope you will uh, join me. So first let's have a look at the materials I've used. Uh, it's not a lot of materials actually. The stamps are the small branch, uh, the fairy fir tree, and that, that little sweet Max, and the uh, this one from the Wallace family. I think it's Mrs. Wallace, actually. I've used multifarious card this time, and it, the measure is 12.5 times 14.5 uh, centimeters. It's not a very big uh, uh, piece. I've only used uh, like uh, two different inks. It's only the uh, Nocturne and the Rainforest, both uh, versus uh, Fine Claire, of course. I made a little uh, swatch uh, with my watercolors. Uh, it's uh, Ultramarine and Meadows Lake to make this uh, purple uh, uh, sky and also some paints gray to darken it. And I've also used some uh, white gouache. And it's uh, from my tubes, my Winsor & Newton tubes. We need some uh, ordinary table salt and some uh, masking liquid with a kind of a rubbish uh, uh, brush uh, for this. It's just for the moon, actually. And I've also d done a little bit of uh, embossing some branches. And I used the verse mark, of course, and the white puff uh, twinkle. Uh, this is really shiny and nice, actually. I've used some pens, uh, the big Posca, it's a, it's a kind of broad one for some uh, snow and a black one for some edging and also this uh, thin uh, uh, white uh, Posca and some silver, it's uh, my Uniball uh, Signal silver pen, it's really really shiny and I love those. Um, I've used a Micron 01 for some uh, writing on the card and also some uh, uh, pastel, a uh, pastel pen for um, some shadowing on the animals and a normal pencil. A few brushes, one broad one for watering down the, color, uh, the, the card and some uh, smaller ones. And uh, some uh, pan pastel, I've used the titanium white just to give the moon some uh, glow and this little applicator, and my white uh, gouache uh, for some uh, snow and uh, some on the background. And that's uh, it. Oh, well, uh, I, ne uh, I need a little mask for the moon. I would just I don't have this moon mask, so I just made one. It's uh, four centimeters in diameter, 1.57 uh, inches. But if you have the moon mask, you can, of course, use the uh, moon mask. And that's it. That's all the materials. So, let's start. The card is uh, multifarious. I've used multifarious this time. Uh, and it's uh, 12.5 uh, times 14.5 centimeters. And as you know, um, multifarious is really smooth and lovely to work with. And uh, holds c quite a lot of water, actually. We start with the moon. I've made this uh, die cut this, and I'm going to put it up in the left uh, corner and uh, cover it with uh, masking fluid. And I will put on some music now because you don't need to listen to my boring voice. Uh, see you later guys, have fun. And uh, yeah, <laughs> just follow the tutorial. See you. Karma keeps me cautious 
So guys, all finished. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I sure enjoyed making this card. And as usual, this is the first for me as well. I never do this um, kind of sam uh, make one uh, sample and then uh, re replicate it. Um, it is my style. It's a lot of watercolors and a lot of different techniques. I love that. And I hope you can see the silver shine on it. It's really, really nice. And uh, I've matted it with some really nice uh, purple uh, cardstock. I really do love uh, that uh, kind of edging uh, I've done on this card uh, with the uh, white edge on ac the actual uh, cardstock. And I do that a lot on my other pieces, as I told you. Um, uh, if you don't have the same materials as me, use what you have, uh, use the colors you like, but do follow the steps if you want uh, a similar uh, card in the end. Uh, you have to do that. And of course, if there's anything you wonder about, please PM me as usual and I will answer you as quickly as I can. Well guys, this was the first uh, card for the year and there will be, be plenty more. So, see you next time. Bye bye. Have a nice week. Bye. Sick with one.